Hello, Dr. Larry here. I hope you're doing well today. So I was on my soul walk today and got a very powerful message. And the message is, if you're on a certain path and you get steered on to go a different path, to allow it to be what it is, okay? Because a lot of times we, our ego wants to know what's going to happen. We want to be sure that we know what the next steps are. We want to know what our future is. We want to know where we're going. And when we have an idea that we know where we're going, we kind of feel settled, right? So this happened to us um, in our family. We were on a certain path and we were sure that it was going to be this path. And then like we got a wrench thrown in our spokes and it completely derailed us to go on a different path. And it was hard. We were like, whoa, because it was a, it's a big thing. <laughs> so for a few days, I was just like in it. I was like, oh my gosh, why is this happening? And I was angry and I didn't understand, but I allowed myself to feel those emotions. And once I got out of that, that fear and that expectation that things should be this way, um, I was able to move through it to a different side of it. And when I got out of it, I just kind of sat with it, okay? And this was the message today, is if you are getting pushed in a different direction, allow yourself to feel the feelings, but know that everything that happens in your life happens for a reason. And life is always transpiring for your highest good, always. Even if you can't see it in the moment. So if you're, you know, in a relationship and you can see the writing on the wall, it's like, oh my gosh, this isn't for me, but you're scared to let go because you don't know what the future holds. Or if you're in a job right now and you're just, your soul is just being sucked dry and you know that it's time to leave, but you don't know where to go. So it, it's things like this, that when this comes into your life, know that it's for a reason and that you are being guided to your highest and best good. Always, always, always. And that goes for your loved ones too. So you're not just being guided towards your highest good. Your loved ones are being guided towards their highest good. No matter what decisions they make, no matter where they are in their life, that they are being guided as well. So the big message here is to trust Trust that where you are is exactly where you need to be and that everything that's being taken out of your life, it's making room for the new stuff to come in, the better stuff to come in, the more love, the more opportunities, the more adventure, the more imagination, the more abundance. But you can't have all of that new stuff if you're still holding on to uh, what's familiar. And I think that's why we hold on to what's familiar because you know, that's where we feel safe. And it doesn't feel very safe to be in the unknown. But if you come from a place of the, the knowing that life is always transpiring for your highest good and you let go of the expectation of how you think things should be, that's when you start to gain a little bit more footing and a little bit more inner peace. So I hope that helps. I know it helped me. We're still in the middle of doing what we have to do and going in a different direction. And it's still a little teeter-totter sometimes and stressful, but ultimately I have a deep knowing that we are all being guided to our highest and best good. And so are you. Have a beautiful, beautiful day. Thanks for listening.